at 10, incredible images of a water spout near Pelahatchee Bay. Tornado sirens blared near Castlewood subdivision in Rankin County as it crossed the water. So far, no reports of any damage. Let's get straight to 16 WAPT's Tammy Eswick. She is live at the reservoir. And Tammy, you talked to people who saw that water spout. Yeah, that's right. We've been talking to residents in Rankin County all evening. They say when they first saw it, they thought it was a tornado. We've also been getting pictures and video from 16 WAPT viewers all evening, like one from Brian Horton. He says as soon as he saw the water spout along Three Prong Road, he had to pull over to the side and start taking video and pictures of it. Now, we talked to some residents, one in particular, who said he had just pulled into his driveway after a long day at work. And saw the water spout not far from him. Well, it started um, at the corner here at this wood line, and the and the water's probably only uh, 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 half a mile behind the, that wood line, and it, it started there, and it went. Uh, you know, by the time it finished up, it was back over here behind that house uh, over here. What were you thinking when when you I saw thought, it in the air? Thoughts tornado. What were you thinking? Uh, I thought it was tornado too. Some people were excited, some people terrified to see that water spout in the water here on the res. The Lewis boys say they were out with their father, father fishing when they saw the spout. Their youngest brother says he couldn't wait to get home and get inside. Now, we do think it's important to let viewers know at home that this water spout actually never crossed onto land, and we didn't get any reports of damage so far this evening. Live at the res, Tammy Eswick, 16 WAPT News. All right, Tammy, thank you so much. Let's bring in our chief meteorologist, David Hartman, with a closer look at the water. Spout. It lasted seven minutes. Uh -huh. And did you see how it was tilted like that? Yeah, that was that was the storm way. outflow, cooler okay. air pushing it that way, which was kind of cool. But uh, we did we were able to see it on radar. We've circled the area there. This is a non-tornadic water spout, a rotating column of air, very close to a developing thunderstorm, non-severe. The storm was not severe, but you get some shear. It could be from outflow merging with other thunderstorms. It could be kind of like a, a lake breeze. So just a weak EF0 water spout. And uh, rarely do they do any kind of damage. And rarely do they come uh, onto land. We had one back in August of 2012, if you recall. You know, there's little water spouts out there at the uh, res uh, every now and again. Hey, here's a quick look at live storm show 16 Doppler radar. We're in the same position we were last night. What's left of isolated storms? Just about gone, but we should do it again tomorrow. Forecast is coming up. All right, David, and reminder you can track severe weather moving through your area inside WAPT.com. Make sure you download the 16 WAPT Tornado app for up to the minute information about the